day from TIAA Bank Field in Jacksonville, Florida. It's week 18 of the NFL on EA Sports. It's the Jacksonville Jaguars taking on the Indianapolis Colts. EA Sports coverage of the NFL brings us to the Sunshine State in TIAA Bank Field here in Jacksonville. This crowd excited to see their Jaguars as both teams emerge from their tunnels a moment ago. We are just about ready for football as the Jags get set to match up with the Indianapolis Colts. Alongside my partner, Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gold. Did you look at this Jaguar team? So the football will be at the 25-yard line as this offense gets set to take over. On first down, Madden. And his first look is incomplete. So, Charles, you look at this offense, and really on paper, at least, a great situation for them upcoming. They're unbeaten on the year, an open week coming up after this. So I guess my question, any worry that maybe this is coming at the wrong time? Oh, definitely I would be worried about this game, maybe more than any other on the schedule, because I know my guys are looking ahead to that open week. I've got to keep them focused on the task ahead, make sure they take care of business in this one. Otherwise, you're talking about a double trap. The trap of losing the game and then having the open week and having to stew about it. So still a scoreless game in the first, but they're going to go for this thing on their own side of the field on fourth down. They're going to try and throw. Obviously, they didn't get everything they wanted on that completion, but... Oh, what a juke into space! They're able to rip off a big chunk of yardage before being dropped inside the 40. from Colts territory. Here's a first and 10 at the 38. On first down, it's Robinson. Oh, an absolutely filthy juke. He's got some space now. And he takes it in. Touchdown, Jacksonville. James Robinson. The Jacksonville offense set to begin their next drive. And coming up on their second drive of the game, had the touchdown last time out. Now they have the football back. Chance to really seize early momentum. Feels to me like they had a really excellent week of practice that it all came together. But I'll bet you it got galvanized in the locker room in pregame. Somehow I think the head coach, his oratorical skills were on point. And a dangerous throw there, incomplete. He threw that into coverage. It was nearly intercepted. And second and ten, he'll look to throw again. Escaping the pressure right. And he'll go down at the 26, following a gain of six. From the gun on third down, Madden. Now he'll let it go on the run. Deep left side. And that is going to be pulled in one-handed. Touchdown, Jaguar. DJ Shark. Jaguars come to the line to start their next drive. And thus far, the weather has not slowed this offense down one bit. They've looked good so far in the first half. They certainly have. And think back to our meeting with the head coach. And we asked him because we saw the forecast for this game, didn't we? We said, hey, have you prepared for this? And he talked about the different drills that they've done in adverse conditions, the wet ball drills, things of that nature. He said, I don't think it's going to slow us down much. We tend to handle it pretty well. And he's been right. Off the play fake. Madden. And he's got his man on the crossing route. That's Landry. And he'll go down, but not before getting this inside the 30. 
good job there of getting his tight end involved because he lines up on the right side of the formation, just works his way across the field. I really like how they were in sync on that one. He spotted the open gap in the zone, and his quarterback found him, and they get a first down. The completion, but they go in the wrong direction. The loss of yards, and now they're dealing with a second and long. Play action. Madden, he'll buy some time right. To the right side, and he's got Landry complete. They'll wind up getting 10 back as that sets him up for third down. Now Carter Landry with a the catch there. We've been talking about him the last few weeks, CD, and what he's meant to this offense during this latest run that they're on. Yeah, I've really been impressed by how this offense, but more specifically, this entire team has come together. A lot of times you get guys with different agendas, guys are complaining about playing time. You have all of those factions in a locker room, but not with this team. They've really grown together as one unit, and they're really playing good football as a result. And his throw here is going to be incomplete. So many offenses want to include their running backs into their passing offense and be able to swing the ball out or check it down to them. But sometimes those guys are just not as comfortable catching the ball as they are running it. To the end zone, but it's incomplete. All right, Captain. It's batting down the hatches time defensively. Dodged two pass attempts to the end zone. Now what do you think they're going to try and dial up on third and goal? Well, knowing them and knowing what we... Touchdown, Jaguars! Marvin Jones with a lucky number 13 touchdowns now on the year. And the Jaguars are able to widen their... The Jacksonville offense set to begin their next drive. It was still more than a minute to go in the half. Time to try to mount a drive. And I would think that they would have to. This is today's NFL. you got to push it whenever you get an opportunity. You can never have enough points with the high-powered offenses that you face. And analytics will tell you, try and score when given the opportunity. They'll come up now second and four from the 31. Back to throw. Madden eluding the pressure right. This one hauled in, and again, it's Robinson. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. On first and 10, Madden dancing to his left. He's got a man wide open. It's Landry. Touchdown, Jaguars. Carter Landry. 25th touchdown, tying him at Smith for the fifth most in one season. And the Jaguars. Jaguars come to the line to start their next drive. And they'll start from their own five, so you'd have to imagine they'll stay conservative. And they'll indeed start on the ground to run that clock. There's Robinson showing the flash. And an anxious moment or two there, but they do get him down. The Jaguars going to go ahead and use their first timeout as they'll stop the clock.